APA Formatting The Basics, a vidcast brought to you by Beth Jones and Gina Hurley in cooperation with the Purdue Online Writing Lab. This vidcast takes you through how to format a literature review following APA style. We will be using the sixth edition of the APA Manual. Your instructor may have different guidelines for you to follow. Always follow your instructor's guidelines. Begin by opening your word processor program. For our demonstration here, we will use Microsoft Word 2007. APA recommends using 12-point times New Roman font. Be sure your word processor is set to this font. Spacing, margins, and headers. APA requires all papers to be double-spaced throughout. To set your line spacing to double-space, open up the Paragraph menu in Microsoft Word. Change the default line spacing setting from after 10 point to 0 point, then change line spacing from multiple to double. APA requires that your paper be set to 1 inch on all sides. To do this, open up the Page Layout menu in Microsoft Word. Select Margins, then click on Normal, which should have top, bottom, right, and left margins of 1 inch. You will need to create a page header flush with the left margin at the top of every page. On the title page, this header will be different. It will read Running Head. Include a short version of your paper's title in all capital letters. Your running head cannot exceed 50 characters, including spaces. All subsequent pages will have only the running head title in all capital letters. Do not include the words running head on subsequent pages as shown in this screenshot. You will also need to insert page numbers flush with the right margin. In order to make your first page header different from subsequent pages, select the Page Layout menu, select Page Setup, open up the Layout tab, and place a check in the box by different first page. Doing this will ensure that the phrase running head only shows up on your title page. Sections of your research paper. APA style recommends organizing your paper into the following sections. Title page, abstract, main body, and references. The first of these sections is the title page. Center the title of the paper no more than 12 words in length, the author's name without titles or degrees, and the institutional affiliation. As mentioned before, include a running head in the page header. The running head should include the words running head with a shortened version of your paper's title. Include a colon after the phrase running head. Be sure to capitalize the R in running and the entire title of your running head. Insert page numbers flush right at the top of the page. Include a number on the first page. Start a new page to create your abstract. If you have inserted a header, this page should already include the page header with your title in all capital letters. On the first line, center the word abstract without italics, bolding, underlining, or quotation marks. The first line of the abstract should not be indented. The abstract should be a concise 150 to 200 word summary of your research. You can also include keywords from your paper underneath your abstract. To do this, type, italicize, and indent the word keywords after the abstract. Then type in a few keywords that describe your paper in normal typeface. The main body of your paper should be double spaced. Insert the full title of your paper on this page, which will be page 3. Center the title, do not underline, bold, or italicize it. Indent the first line of each paragraph in the main body of your paper. At the end of the main body of your paper, insert a new page and center the title, References. Do not underline, italicize, or bold this title. Capitalize this title. Then, list all of your in-text citations on this page in alphabetical order by author's last names. Double-space the reference entries throughout. Some final notes. Print your paper on white 8.5 by 11 inch paper. Also, if you are using a word processor other than Microsoft Word 2007, Search YouTube using the name of the processor you are using, such as Microsoft Word for Mac 2011 plus APA formatting. For more information on different types of papers in APA style, visit the Purdue Owl at the following URL. For more information on how to format entries in the References list, visit the Purdue Owl at the following URL. This has been a presentation of APA Formatting the Basics, a vidcast by Beth Jones and Gina Hurley, brought to you in cooperation with the Purdue Online Writing Lab.